Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So if you are unable to make changes in the graphics settings, in the settings of the game, if you if you are not able to make changes, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to disconnect some, uh, like disconnect external peripherals. So if you have any kind of peripherals connected, which you are not using, disconnect it. Unplug external devices. So if you have OTAs, wheel, pedals, any kind of USB adapter connected to the computer, disconnect it. Disconnect extra controller. Sometimes we have extra controller connected, disconnect it. Disconnect multiple monitor. Try launching the game on single monitor. Also, if you have any third party services or application running, close it. If you have undervolted your computer, remove the undervolt and then launch the game. Now, if you have VJoy, if you're using VJoy, you can disable VJoy. So if you have VJoy enabled in device manager, you can make, just make a right click on the start menu, go to device manager. If you find VJoy, you can disable it. You can close VJoy. Or if you have any kind of virtual controller uh, software installed, you can try to disable it and then launch the, launch the game. This has worked for many players, so it might work for you. If that does not work, if your computer has a dual graphic card, in that case, you can disable your discrete graphic card in device manager, then launch the game. Then once you disable it, then launch the game, change the graphic settings, close the game, enable the discrete graphic card, and then launch the game. The game will launch with the change settings. So you can try this. So first of all, if the game is running, uh, close the game first. So if your computer has a dual graphic card, so make a right click in the start menu and then go to device manager. So first of all, close the game if the game is running and then go to device manager, go to display adapter. Now over here, make a right click on your discrete graphic card. So this is the in inbuilt Intel one and this is the discrete. So I will disable my discrete graphic card. Click on yes. Now, once you disable it, in my case here, you can see I have disabled. Once this is disabled, now you can launch the game. Now, once you launch the game, go to settings. So at the top right, click on this gear icon and then you will see everything like grayed out, but still you can change it. So you can go to graphics and over here in my case right now, it's 1680 into 1080p. I will change it to 1920 into 1080p and I, even I will change the resolution. And then once you change it, now click on yes, you press the escape key. When you press the escape key, you will see this option, click on yes. And right now it's 1920 into 1080p. Now you can close the game. So I'm closing the game now. Now, once you close the game, make a right click on the start menu, go to device manager. And then now you can enable your discrete graphic card. So make a right click and then click on enable device. So now I have enabled, so this is enabled now. Now you can launch the game. Now this time when you launch the game, if you go to settings, you will check, you will see the same screen resolution. So you can make changes to the graphics settings. And so you have to disable your discrete graphic card. Then you have to launch the game, change the settings and then close the game. And then you can enable the graphic card and then launch the game. And the settings will remain, you know, whatever changes you have made. So here you can see 1920 into 1080p. Now this is how you can change the resolution. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time. And please like this video and subscribe to my channel.